video here today putting you in first class this video is a challenge from Chandeep of the goodly YouTube channel he based it on a video from Wynn Hopkins so let's look at the challenge oh and by the way I am in my new apartment uh, there's nothing behind me right now. I'm still getting set up, but I'm moved and it feels so damn good. Chandeep's challenge used hobbies and members of his family. And of course, I'm going to put a different twist on it and add some things. We've got these names and these musics. Omar, Rye, Disco and Rock, Lourdes, dance hall and rye and over on the right side we need a grid with trues and falses in it lordes look across there's a true for rye and a true for dance hall but now look at something else that i felt is important to deal with what about people like James who are completely unfun and don't want to go first class? James wants to sit in the mud and be anti-fun, but we still have to account for James in the data. Look at this, James, falses, but if there was a column for unfun, James would have a true. Here we go. We've got all of the data. Right click, get data from table slash range. Table does have headers. Okay. Now there is something that I want to say because in thinking about this, I figured that at some point we're going to have to do a cross join because a cross join mixes everything with everything. We can't just work with one data set um, and then hope it'll all work out. No, we've got to account for um, Omar and High Life. He needs a false. We can't just have Omar, Disco and Rock. We also have to have the things where there are falses. And that means at some point we got to do a cross join. Here we go. First, let's get the musics. Go right there. Highlight that column, right click, remove other columns. We don't need this null. Gonna filter it out. Okay. Next with that column highlighted still. Right click, split column by delimiter. Split it by custom, split it by the comma space. Then we're gonna split it into rows, okay. And then get rid of the duplicates. Right click remove duplicates, call this music. Then I'm gonna close and load. Next, let's get the names. Curse in the data set, right click. Get data from table slash range. Boost this up. I don't want the music, remove. Now, here is where we're gonna do the cross join. Add a column, custom column, equals music. It's that simple, click there. Okay, all of the musics 
are next to everybody. Expand. We don't need this jazz. And then okay. Now we have everybody matched up with every music. Dave and Dance Hall. And then where's Unfun James? Unfun James, funk, dance hall, everything. Good. So let's do this. Musics. No, that needs to be names. Right. Next, I need to get the source data. File. Close and load. Okay, there's that. Let's go back here. Right click. Get data from table slash range. Okay. Boost it up. Go here. Split column by delimiter. Go to advance. Split into rows. Split at what? Custom. Split it at comma space. First class up in the sky. Woo, look at that. Next, I'm going to get rid of this null. Okay. We'll call this source unpivoted. Now, merge the queries. Merge. Cancel. I want to merge queries as new. I'm going to put names and then sources unpivoted. Leave this as a left outer join. I'm going to match the name and name. Hold down the control key. Music and music. Okay. Make some room. Expand. We don't need that original column name as prefix. Okay. Now for our trues and falses. But let's look for Unfun James. There is Unfun James. Look at that. He's got all nulls next to his name. So let's get to it. I'm gonna add a column. I need to only highlight one column. Okay. Add a conditional column. If music one equals no, then false else true. Okay, let's clear some stuff out so we can see. I'm gonna right click, remove. Dave has true next to funk, disco. Let's look, Dave, funk, disco. Next, get rid of this, remove it. Now, to pivot, don't aggregate. What do we want as our headers going across the top? We want the musics. What do we want as the values inside the table once this pivoted? We want custom, transform, pivot column, values column. We want custom. Okay. But I need to do that one other thing. Go back here. Advanced. Pivot. Don't aggregate. Okay. There it is. Ah, look at that. All right. Let's go ahead and close and load. We got a lot of stuff to close and load here. Let's take a second. All right. There is the data. I'm going to move it, cut, bring it back, go over here, uh, paste it. Woo. Let's check it out. Close this. Irfan only has rock. Let's look. Irfan has only a true at rock. Good. Now we got to check it out. Uh, right click. Unhide. We got some people and musics that are new 
add them to the data set and G L A M Data Refresh Oh look at oh 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 Norteño is there Zydeco is there Wilson is there Carson is there everything's right let's check it out before we get out of here B has disco Zydeco and dance hall what's happening B disco true dance hall true and Zydeco true I got you the first class don't it feel good? Ah!